Diocletian was a Roman emperor who ruled from 284 to 305 AD. He is known for his role in the Tetrarchy system of the government, which divided the Roman Empire into four regions, each governed by an emperor. This system was intended to improve the stability and efficiency of the empire, but it lasted for nearly 50 years after Diocletian's abdication. Diocletian was born in the Roman province of Dalmatia, which is the modern day Croatia, in 245 AD. He rose to the ranks of the military to become a general under Emperor Carus. After Carus's death, Diocletian seized power and established himself as sole ruler of the empire. One of Diocletian's main achievements was his reform of the empire's monetary system. He introduced a new coinage system which helped stabilize the economy and curb inflation. He also implemented price controls on certain goods which helped to curb inflation as well. Diocletian is also known for his persecution of Christians which became known as the Great Persecution. He ordered the destruction of churches, the execution of Christian leaders and the imprisonment of thousands of Christians. This persecution was aimed at restoring the traditional Roman religion which had been declining in popularity. Diocletian was a strong and effective ruler but his reign was not without its challenges. The empire was constantly threatened by barbarian invasions and internal rebellions and Diocletian also had to deal with the problem of succession as he had no natural heir to the throne. In 305 AD, Diocletian decided to abdicate and retire to his palace in Split, Croatia. He divided the empire between his two emperors, Maximin and Constantinus, and their respective Caesars, Galerius and Flavius Saurus. The system of government known as Tetrarchy helped to maintain the stability of the empire for the next 50 years. In conclusion then, Diocletian was a significant figure in the history of the Roman Empire. He introduced a new system of government which helped to maintain the stability of the empire. He also implemented economic and monetary reforms which helped to stabilise the economy. Despite his persecution of Christians, Diocletian is considered one of the last great Roman emperors.